Sounds our house, Master Davy. That's a boat, ain't it? <laughs> you run out and look closer. If it had been Aladdin's palace, I could not have been more charmed with the romantic idea of living in it. The true wonder of it was that it was a real boat that must have been upon the oceans hundreds, thousands of times. Mr. Copperfield. Copperfield. I'm Donald Faggerty. Glad to see you, sir. You'll find us rough, sir, but you'll find us ready. This is little Emily, sir. Emily, say hi to do to Mr. Copperfield. <laughs> well, sister. How are you, lad? All right, my love. <laughs> Come on, Davy. <gasps> Mr. Peggotty? Sir. Did you give your son the name of Ham because you live in the Noah's Ark? No, sir. His father gave him that name. But I thought you were his father. My brother Joe was his father. Dead, Mr. Peggotty. Drowned. But this Lemley, she's your daughter, isn't she? No, sir. My brother-in-law, Tom, was her father. Not dead, Mr. Peggotty. Drowned. It. Have you any children, then? <laughs> no, sir. I'm a bachelor door. A bachelor? Then, who's this? Time you were bed, Master Davy. There's their old girl. Her name's Mrs. Gummidge. Her man and Dunnell was partners in a boat. But old Gummidge died and left her very poor. So Dunnell took her in. Like Ham and little Emily when they was orphaned. He must be a very good man, I should think. The best of men. Hmm. To bed with you now. Good night. <laughs> night. Davy. Yes, Peggy. My brother Darnell, he don't like have that goodness and generosity of his spoken of. Not by anybody, not in his hearing. I won't mention it. Don't. It makes him swear something terrible would do. I wake, and I think I hear Uncle Daniel and Ham crying out for help. Does it make you remember your father? I never knew him. That's like me. But you and your mother, hadn't you? I lost my mother, too. Besides, your father was a gentleman, and more in a fisherman, like Uncle Daniel. Pegasus said I should never mention what a good man he is. Good! If I was ever to be a lady, I'd give him a sky blue coat, with diamond buttons, a red velvet waistcoat, a cocked hat, a gold watch, and a box of money. Would you like to be a lady, Emily? Yes, very much. <laughs> Emily, wait! <laughs>